The action of this musical takes place in an imaginary country seeking a Brexit from the European Union. Any resemblance between the fictional main characters in the musical and real, sentient, rational beings is entirely coincidental. They think I will Brexit's remain, a musical trick. We will Brexit. You may love it, you may loathe it, you may feel it was a bit of a shambles to get there. Actually, people on both sides of the argument think it was a little bit of a shambles to get there. Here is the musical. Full-length musical telling the story of an imaginary country seeking a Brexit from the European Union, though you may see some parallels. Enjoy this musical because somebody you love would love to get this as a present from you. And by the end of this video, I'm going to tell you how you can get the book for free. So, we encounter in Brexit's musical trick, for, uh, first of all, Boris Val Boris, who is trying to decide whether to lie or not. When I could lead the fight to depart from EU. If I speak, I am adored. If I stay silent, I'll be bored. We encounter the people, uh, several groups of people, who know what they're voting for. So you'll just hear a little snatch of this here. But in the full song, there are four different groups, uh, three of whom are in favour of leave, only one in favour of remain, but they all sing about what they are voting for. And there is Cameroon, who holds a hasty referendum. Hold a hasty referendum with two options on the card. There are rules, but we can bend them. But it cannot be that hard. Cameroon loses the referendum, resigns. Leave campaign from the beginning, made some claims that were not right. But it seems the score show winning for the Leave team. That is right. But now, Dave, you left so early. Surely something slipped your mind. You forgot implementation. Would you leave this and task behind? At the end of the day, you have need of a leader. At the end of the day, we have need of a leader. And Boris is at, he has messed up his chance. And so Teraline emerges. However, Rhys Moggy has his doubts. And what have we here, oh you closet remainer? Teraline, tell us all, oh this we beseech. I should now make it plain that it's best to remain. Now you think you can reign, it's a hell of a speech. Give me that speech back! Teraline now gets dragged into the murky world of lovely tax breaks. I smell tax breaks, tax breaks in UK, and the other territories is paradise today. Lovely tax breaks which the EU lacks. Where's the opportunity to never pay your tax? Tax evaders like to hide the but, facts. Meanwhile, the rascally innkeeper, Faragier, believes he is the master of the spiel. Um, and thinks that he has a trick or two to tell. Hello, dear folk, you can trust me. I'll do the work to leave the EC. There are countries do fine outside. Norway is one. Enjoy the ride. Now, I'm not going to introduce you to every song. But you must hear the street urchin called Bosch. They laugh at me because I don't have number 10 keys. They laugh at me because of low support by MPs. Teraline sort of wins an election and having sung a duet with Arlene comes to Parliament. Uh, but the queen of our fictional country is unimpressed about being there when she'd prefer to be at the races. And she demonstrates how unimpressed she is. Order! When you fuck it up, 
one's ascot, one does not think much of that. On a tent, but where's one's mascot? Blue and yellow EU hat. When you first came to the palace, thinking you knew what to do, and you sought the poisoned chalice, did you know you had no clue? Well, Four blokes with paste buckets start pasting the truth about what people have said. The establishment is a dangerous foe. They may arrest us for criminal mess. But starting from here, there's a long way to go. If we're accused, then we'll have to confess. We need a fund to rally the people, to show them they're wise, and to show them the lies. And this all builds up to a denouement, one day more, at Terraline's country house, coincidentally called Checkers. Another plan, another checkers farce. At least I told them if they want their cars. These folks I put in cabinet cannot resign or not just yet. One day more. I did not drive myself today. How to get back if resignation. One day more. Tomorrow I'll be off to play. I've had enough negotiations. So, I've been talking about the songs in Act 1 and Act 2 of Brexit's musical trick. Uh, there is Act 3, where Boris Val Boris is brought in to be Prime Minister, the leader of the country. Uh, and you can catch all of those on this CD. Uh, we recorded this during lockdown, so Ben Chambers recorded one singer at a time and, through his brilliance, mixed this and mastered it to produce the CD that you see here. And if you uh, see, for example, One Day More, listen to it, you'll understand just how complicated that was. I won't go into the whole of Act 3. I, I will briefly mention, because I'm getting to that free book, uh, I don't beg pardon, I'm talking bullocks from the Rose Garden. Uh, and this is the five-act COVID-19 musical, which is actually a suggestion from the Sunday Times. It said to me, Mike, are you writing Coronavirus the Musical? Um, and so we have Act 1, Preparation, Act 2, Expedition to Barnard Castle, Act 3, Prevention, Act 4, Distraction by Brexit, Act 5, Congestion, Reflection and Reward of the Undeserving. So I'm not going to give you excerpts of all of the songs here, though you can find an, um, some of them on this channel. Um, so they're mostly solos, but there are some duets by, for example, Leon Berger uh, and Selwyn Tillett. Leon knows more than any person alive about Flanders and Swan, for example, which we are uh, parodying. Um, and he sings some G Gilbert and Sullivan's as well. Boris has got a little list, uh, for example. Some tremendous um, pieces, uh, Portaloo, Kent Convoy. Uh, and we finish with a Gilbert and Sullivan takeoff, public inquiry nightmare. Uh, but I must mention the denouement of Act 4, Britannia Waves the Rules, uh, composition by Zena Wigram and orchestrated entirely by Roger Knight. Uh, and that's a wonderful alternative, Britannia. Right. Now let's get to the free book. Um, because I am offering, until December the 12th, a book absolutely free. Uh, which is the lyrics of Brexit's musical trick. And there's far more in that than the 25 songs that we've included in the, on the CD, or 24 songs in a poem. Uh, so this uh, includes the entire Brexit's musical trick musical, uh, picking up every major tune from Les Miserables. Uh, and the way that you get it, here's the offer that I'm making until December the 12th. If you buy two CDs then I will throw in the book for free. Uh, you don't have to do anything else to achieve that. Just place an order on Amazon or Etsy for um, Brexit's Musical Trick and I Don't Beg Pardon. Um, or you can buy a Brexit's Musical Trick for yourself and another one for a friend. That's fine. I'll put in this book. Uh, if you want, alternatively, one of the other books, uh, the original Brexit's a Trick, Not a Treat, uh, or the I Don't Beg Pardon I'm talking bollocks from the Rose Garden, full of other satirical songs. Uh, just if you're on Etsy, send me a message through Etsy. Uh, if you're buying the music from Amazon, which is the other place that you can get it, uh, you'll need to send an email to 
info at viewdelta.com uh, saying which book you'd prefer. But my default assumption is going to be that you'd like the lyrics that go with Brexit's a musical trick. The reason I'm making the offer, actually, is I need to decide. This is the stock of Brexit's a musical trick at the moment. I need to decide uh, fairly quickly whether to place a further order for more CDs to be cut uh, ready for Christmas. So I'm trying to accelerate some of the Christmas gift orders. Uh, so that's why the offer is available until December the 12th. Uh, buy two CDs. Um, any two CDs, then you will get uh, this book or one of the other ones for free thrown in with it. And if you buy the Sovereignty OO package, uh, which gives you completely empty box labelled Sovereignty, but also uh, three books and two CDs with it, uh, then um, you have got the books for yourself, but I will again throw in an extra book which you can use as a present for a friend. Uh, so there you are. Free book offer until December the 12th. Uh, please do take it up uh, if uh, you know anybody who would like any of this stuff as a gift. And you do. You know somebody who would love it. All the profits go to coronavirus charities. That's it. That's my little plug. Thank you. My humble speech I've spoken of behavior that we've seen. For our parliament is broken, and he told lies to the Queen. Here he talked of prorogation, and he chose a five week slot. Manly idleness oration He disparaged Gully Swat From the pen of that advisor They could see a house unplugged And they went with privy council And I can hear The very lies that they had said became their own conviction as they planned the houses both prorogued. Oh, my friends, my friends, don't let them. If we're gone, then they will play. Empty houses, empty benches, we should not be sent away. Scrutiny for legislation, missed its chance if we're not here. Empty houses, empty benches, making MPs disappear. Oh, my friends, my friends, don't ask me what the heck this plan was for. Empty houses, empty benches, and the scrutiny no more.